Okay, everybody, up top. I know I am. Ooh, this sweet new stash over the summer. <laughs> okay, A, I'd hardly call that stash. And B, can you just admit you're nervous like the rest of us? I don't think I can go through with it. Just take a deep breath and get a grip. <laughs> I figure out what's going on with my sponge cake. No! Sorry, bro. I'm going to have to write you up for ordering in a no stopping zone. Sonny, are you aware that Ancestral Past is redundant? Okay, it's our fault this spring dance had to be held in the boring hall lot of the young Fight! And what did you guys bring to trade? Who wants my grilled cheese? The world has been throwing me aside for years. My chef, the Centennial Chihuahua, was on pace to finish the castle run in 11 parsecs. Cut me off. That's off limit. I never trade my cup. The second one's going to be the last one can bring this back and cheese bite. Let's see. That's so lame. It should be me. Sweet. Now we don't have a map. I am proud to say that I am a quarter Greek, three eighths Italian, five sixteenths Tex Arcanian, and one thirty second Glutonian. That makes me a purebred American muck. Now here is some indigenous American music. Madison's got a tiny pop it up, but it's speaking. Your planet's over here. As you can see, we're falling apart without you, buddy. I hope you remember what your wish was. Hey, I've got the same model. Are you saying I did it? I bought one of them too. We keep it on the front porch. Princess of despair, mistress of darkness, I am Persephone. I am Haiku, and I did not prepare anything. Which would have been a smart idea if you hadn't given me the exact same birthday gift the exact same day. Anyway, listeners, as you can tell, we're absolutely thrilled you're joining us as we conduct a seance. We even have the same birthday. That means talk to the dead. Thank you, Haiku. Yes, we're hoping to chat with an old friend and a former mascot of our school. Well, excuse me for trying to give you a little style, Melvin. Remember, watch out for open... I hear the fluttering of butterflies. Let's all join hands and stand around Ricky's headstone. You're right, it was a call for attention. Hey, this elevator's quit singing. <laughs> we'll just do this at my house. Come on, everybody. At least I don't sleep with a ratty, one-eyed, stuffed bunny rat because I'm afraid of the dark. Tough talk from someone with an irrational fear of hang walking into a block of angry malware. <laughs> Just light driver. At least the day's that's over that's and I can rest. Huh? Sonny, you can tell us. Hey, no speeding! Oh, Red, I wanted to use the TV! No! Was I really? This letter was made for Sonny! His squad chart! It's in love with him! Oh, my wonder principal Luna was so upset! He didn't want to see Sonny get his heart broken! Okay, let's see if it fools them! Oh, no, this note is the worst thing that's ever hit me in the head! What? I don't have any boogers on my fingers! Control. It's not that. I just got to the last level and I only have one life left. I can't risk losing it. What am I gonna do? Of course. Bill, what do you want? Can't you see I'm trying to think? What are you doing? You're putting your entire world view on the line, and for what? A bunch of bikes? All a romantic three-course waste. This cotton doesn't like Sunny at all. You're going to Paris? That's nice. But we gotta get things ready for Miss Cotton Chatter's date with Sunny. Now for the rest of you, as soon as Lincoln wakes up, he's gonna wanna play that game. So we need an excuse to get him out of the house before he can. Crud! We're on our way back. What you say? Sonny has a crush on Miss Squat and Chatter. Do I need to draw you a picture? Oh, can I do it? Lincoln was really good at that escape room. They finished with 20 minutes to spare. I need more time! I got this. You mean we set up this romantic date for Sonny and Miss Squat and Chatter? I can't believe you did this. I just made the cutest couple. I'm sorry. I spent all day trying to get you back to the trash castle. No, that's true. She is not a member. But Sonny wrote her that 
love letters, and she draws them crazy. Yes, I mean, yeah, sure, you know, whatever. I'll go crazy in this school. That's great, and all for you, Alice. But every time Trixie tries to do friendship, Lucy, Ricky isn't going to feel comfortable returning to a place with this many dogs, aka predators for a rooster. We need to relocate again, Horace. That'd be great. And come to think of it, none of us have ever seen where you live before. One time, I went crazy, but it turned out caterpillar had just laid its eggs in my ear I was paying attention, and the answer is... But now it turns out Miss Wanchetter doesn't like Sunny at all! It says so right here in this paper! Yes? It ain't even no name on his letter. It could be to anybody. He did it! Good old pony! He always looks out for me. It says she doesn't like his music. Who else in this school even plays music? It is a school for performing arts. It's a good thing Principal Luna threw this letter at my hand before it could get to Sunny. And we gotta cancel the state before it's too late. Too late. It looks just like the blueprint you drew. No! 